Lagos, Yoruba, Echo is a city in the Nigerian state of the same name. The city, with its adjoining conurbation, is the most populous in Nigeria and on the African continent. It is one of the fastest growing cities in the world and one of the most populous urban areas. Lagos is a major financial center in Africa. The megacity has the fourth highest GDP in Africa and houses one of the largest and busiest seaports on the continent. Lagos initially emerged as a port city that originated on a collection of islands, which are contained in the present day local government areas LGAs of Lagos Island, Etiosa, Amuo Odafin, and Apapa. The islands are separated by creeks, fringing the southwest mouth of Lagos Lagoon, while being protected from the Atlantic Ocean by barrier islands and long sand spits such as Bar Beach, which stretch up to 100 kilometers (62 miles) east and west of the mouth. Due to rapid urbanization, the city expanded to the west of the lagoon to include areas in the present-day Lagos mainland, Ajiromi Ifeladan and Suruliri. This led to the classification of Lagos into two main areas, the island, which was the initial city of Lagos, before it expanded into the area known as the mainland. This city area was governed directly by the federal government through the Lagos City Council, until the creation of Lagos State in 1967, which led to the splitting of Lagos City into the present-day seven local government areas LGAs, and an addition of other towns which now make up 13 LGAs from the then western region, to form the state, Lagos, the capital of Nigeria since its amalgamation in 1914, went on to become the capital capital of Lagos State after its creation. However, the state capital was later moved to Akeja in 1976, and the federal capital moved to Abuja in 1991. Even though Lagos is still widely referred to as a city, the present-day Lagos, also known as Metropolitan Lagos, and officially as Lagos Metropolitan Area is an urban agglomeration or conurbation, consisting of 20 LGAs, 32 LCDAs including Akeja, the state capital of Lagos State. This conurbation makes up 37% of Lagos State's total land area, but houses about 85% of the state's total population. The exact population of metropolitan Lagos is disputed. In the 2006 federal census data, the conurbation had a population of about 8 million people. However, the figure was disputed by the Lagos state government, which later released its own population data, putting the population of Lagos metropolitan area at approximately 16 million. As of 2015, unofficial figures put the population of Greater Metropolitan Lagos which includes Lagos and its surrounding metro area, extending as far as into Ogun State, at approximately 21 million. History Lagos was originally inhabited by the Awari subgroup of the Yoruba people in the 15th century. Under the leadership of the Aloi Olafin, the Awari moved to an island now called Iddo and then to the larger Lagos Island. In the 16th century, the Awari settlement was conquered by the Benin Empire and the island became a Benin war camp called Echo under Oba Orhogbua, the Oba of Benin at the time. Echo is still the native name for Lagos. Lagos, which means lakes was a name given to the settlement by the Portuguese. Throughout history, it was home to a number of warring ethnic groups who had settled in the area. Following its early settlement by the Awari nobility, and its conquest by the Bani warlords of Benin, the state first came to the attention of the Portuguese in the 15th century. Portuguese explorer Rui de Sequeira visited the area in 1472, naming the area around the city Lago de Caramo. Another explanation is that Lagos is a Portuguese named after a major port in Portugal. A maritime town that, at the time, was the main centre of Portuguese expeditions down the African coast. 
In Britain's early 19th century fight against the transatlantic slave trade, its West Africa Squadron or Preventative Squadron as it was also known, continued to pursue Portuguese, American, French and Cuban slave ships and to impose anti-slavery treaties with West African coastal chiefs with so much doggedness that they created a strong presence along the West African coast from Sierra Leone all the way to the Niger Delta today's Nigeria and as far south as Congo. Congo. In 1849, Britain appointed John Beecroft Consul of the Bights of Benin and Biafra, a position he held along with his governorship of Fernando Po until his death in 1854. John Duncan was appointed Vice Consul and was located at Waida. At the time of Beecroft's appointment, the Kingdom of Lagos under Oba Kosoko was in the western part of the Consulate of the Bights of Benin and Biafra and was a key slave trading port. In 1851 and with pressure from liberated slaves who now wielded political and business influence, Britain intervened in Lagos in what is now known as the Bombardment of Lagos or Capture of Lagos resulting in the installation of Oba Akitoy and the ouster of Oba Kosoko. Oba Akitoy then signed the treaty between Great Britain and Lagos abolishing slavery. The signing of the 1852 treaty ushered in the consular period in Lagos history wherein Britain provided military protection to Lagos, following threats from Kosoko and the French who were positioned at Waida. A decision was made by Lord Palmerston British Prime Minister who noted in 1861, "...the expediency of losing no time in assuming the formal protectorate of Lagos." William McCoskrie, the acting consul in Lagos with Commander Bedingfield convened a meeting with Oba Dosunmu on 30 July 1861 aboard HMS Prometheus where Britain's intent was explained and a response to the terms were required by August 1861. Dosunmu resisted the terms of the treaty but under the threat to unleash violence on Lagos by Commander Bedingfield, Dosunmu relented and signed the Lagos Treaty of Session on 6 August 1861. Lagos was declared a colony on 5 March 1862. The remainder of modern-day Nigeria was seized in 1887, and when the colony and protectorate of Nigeria was established in 1914, Lagos became its capital, continuing as such after the country's independence from Britain in 1960. Along with migrants from all over Nigeria and other West African nations were the returnee ex-slaves known as Creoles, who came from Freetown, Sierra Leone, Brazil and the West Indies to Lagos. The Creoles contributed to Lagos modernization and their knowledge of Portuguese architecture can still be seen from the architecture on Lagos Island. Since the 19th century, Lagos gradually transformed to a melting pot of Africans and Europeans. Railway links and telephone cables connecting Lagos to London had been established by 1886. Electric street lighting was introduced in the city in 1898. Lagos experienced rapid growth throughout the 1960s and 1970s as a result of Nigeria's economic boom. Before the creation of Lagos State on the 27th of May 1967, Lagos, which was the country's capital, had been administered directly by the federal government as a federal territory through the Federal Ministry of Lagos Affairs, while the Lagos City Council (LCC) governed the city. Lagos, along with the towns from the then western region Akeja, Ajej, Mushin, Ikorodu, Epe and Batagri, were eventually captured to create Lagos State. Lagos City was split into the present-day seven local government areas LGAs, while the other towns now make up 13 LGAs in the state. Lagos played the dual role of being the state and federal capital until 1976 when the state capital was moved to Akeja. Lagos was adversely affected during Nigeria's military rule. Also, on 12 December 1991, the seat of the federal government was also formally relocated to Abuja. However, Lagos still remains the financial center of the country, and also grew to become the most populous conurbation in the country. Geography 
Lagos is loosely classified into two main geographical areas the island and the mainland. Topic: Cityscape. Topic: Island. The island is a loose geographical term that is used to define the area of Lagos that is separated from the mainland by the main channel draining the lagoon into the Atlantic Ocean, which forms Lagos Harbour. The island is mainly a collection of islands that are separated from each other by creeks of varying sizes and are connected together by bridges. The smaller sections of some creeks have been dredged and built over. This part of Lagos is the area where most business activities and entertainment events in Lagos takes place. It also houses most of the upscale residential areas in Lagos. The local government areas LGAs that are considered to be in the island include Lagos Island, Amuwo Odafan, Apapa sometimes also regarded as being on the mainland, and Eti Osa. The major upscale island neighborhoods within these LGAs include Ikoyi and Victoria Island. Three major bridges join the island to the mainland. They are the Carter Bridge, which starts from IDDO, the Echo Bridge formerly called the Second Mainland Bridge, and the Third Mainland Bridge, which passes through densely populated mainland suburbs to the Lagos Lagoon. Topic. Lagos Island Lagos Island contains a central business district. This district is characterized by high-rise buildings. The island also contains many of the city's largest wholesale marketplaces such as the popular Idumota and Balogun markets. It also has the National Museum of Nigeria, the Central Mosque, the Glover Memorial Hall, Christ's Church Cathedral and the Obas Palace Another major part of Lagos Island is Marina. It borders around the Idumota and Balogun markets and houses major banking institutions. Though formerly in a derelict condition, Lagos Island's Tanubu Square is a site of historical importance. It was here that the amalgamation ceremony that unified the North and South Protectorate to form Nigeria took place in 1914. Topic: Ikoyi Ikoyi is situated on the eastern half of Lagos Island and joined to it by a land fill. Ikoyi is also connected to Victoria Island by Philoma Bridge, which carries the main road over 5 Cowrie Creek. Ikoyi housed the headquarters of the Federal Government of Nigeria and other buildings owned by the government, including the old Federal Secretariat complex. The complex today is on re-establishment. In Ikoyi there are military and police barracks, a top security prison and a federal high court of Nigeria. Ikoyi also has a number of hotels, night clubs, a recreational park and one of Africa's largest golf courses. Originally a middle-class neighborhood, in recent years, it has become a fashionable residential enclave for the upper middle class to the upper class. There are also commercial activities in Ikoyi, which is spotted in an increasing number of offices, banks, and shopping complexes. The commercial section is concentrated in the southwest. Topic. Victoria Island Victoria Island with its annex is situated to the south of Lagos Island. It has expensive real estate properties and for that reason, many new luxury condos and apartments are blooming up everywhere. Along with Ikoyi, Victoria Island occupies a major area in Lagos that boasts of several sizable shopping districts. On its seashore along the Atlantic front, there is environmentally reconstructed Bar Beach. 
One of the most important streets in Victoria Island Lagos is Saka Tanubu Street because it is where telecommunication business is done majorly. There is a plaza called GSM Plaza where buying and selling of mobile phones and its accessories and other related businesses are carried out. It was founded in 2001. A group of young men came together to form a small business outlets with each one having landline phone on the table and people made calls on pay as you use basis, but there was a new tune between 2002 2003 when GSM business commences in a bigger picture in Nigeria. Today, it is a well known place. Topic. IDDO Across the main channel of the lagoon from Lagos Island, there is a smaller settlement called IDDO. IDDO is also a railroad terminus and it is now situated in the Lagos mainland local government area after it was connected to the mainland like a peninsula. Topic: Mainland A huge population of Lagosians also live on the Lagos mainland, and most industries are located there. The mainland is known for its music and nightlife, which used to be located in areas around Yaba and Suruliri. However, in recent years more night clubs have sprung up on the island, making the island particularly Victoria Island and Lekki Phase 1 the main nightlife attractions. Mainland LGAs include Suruliri, Ajiromi Ifaladin and Lagos Mainland. Metropolitan Lagos suburban LGAs include, Ajej, Apapa, Mushan, Oshadi Isolo and Akeja site of Murtala Muhammad International Airport and the capital of Lagos State. Major areas on the mainland include Ebute Meta, Yaba and Ejigbo. Some rivers, like Batagri Creek, flow parallel to the coast for some distance before exiting through the sand bars to the sea. Climate Lagos experiences a tropical savanna climate ah, according to the Köppen climate classification, as there's a significant precipitation difference between the wet season and the dry season. The wet season starts in April and ends in October, while the dry season starts in November and ends in March. The wettest month is June with precipitation total 315.5 mm in, while the driest month is January with precipitation total 13.2 mm in. Located near the equator, Lagos has only a slight seasonal temperature variation, with high temperatures ranging 28.3 to 32.9 degrees Celsius .9 to .2 degrees Fahrenheit. Lagos shares the seasons of the Southern Hemisphere, with summer highs in March, daily range 32.9 to 24.1 degrees Celsius 91.2 to 75.4 degrees Fahrenheit, and warm winters in August, ranging 28.3 to 21.8 degrees Celsius 82.9 to 71.2 degrees Fahrenheit as the daily average. Topic. Architecture Lagos has the tallest skyline in Nigeria. The architectural styles in Lagos are diverse and ranges from tropical, vernacular to colonial European and ultramodern buildings or a mixture. Brazilian style architecture brought by the Creoles is evident in buildings such as Water House and Shitta Bay Mosque. Skyscrapers and most high-rise buildings are centered on the islands while the mainland has some high-rise buildings. In recent years, the Lagos state government has renovated existing parks and green areas, with a long-term goal of expansion. Many good quality buildings are interspersed across the city. <laughs> Places of worship. 
Among the places of worship, there are Christian churches and temples, Church of Nigeria Anglican Communion, Presbyterian Church of Nigeria World Communion of Reformed Churches, Nigerian Baptist Convention Baptist World Alliance, Living Faith Church Worldwide, Redeemed Christian Church of God, Assemblies of God, Roman Catholic Archdiocese of Lagos Catholic Church and Muslim Mosques. Topic. Administration and demographics In terms of administration, Lagos is not a single municipality and therefore has no overall city administration. The geographical city limits of Metropolitan Lagos comprises 16 of the 20 local government areas, which together comprise Lagos State. The latter entity provides overall government for the metropolitan region. The municipality of Lagos, which covered Lagos Island, Ikoyi, and Victoria Island as well as some mainland territory, was managed by the Lagos City Council LCC, but it was disbanded in 1976 and divided into several local government areas most notably Lagos Island LGA, Lagos Mainland LGA and ETI OSA LGA, the mainland beyond the municipality of Lagos, on the other hand, comprised several several separate towns and settlements such as Mushan, Akeja and Ajej. In the wake of the 1970s Nigerian oil boom, Lagos experienced a population explosion, untamed economic growth, and unmitigated rural migration. This caused the outlying towns and settlements to develop rapidly, thus forming the present-day Lagos Metropolitan Area, also known as Metropolitan Lagos. The history of Lagos is still evidenced in the layout of the LGAs that display the unique identities of the cultures that created them. By 2006, the metro area around Lagos had extended beyond Lagos state's boundaries and attained a megacity status. This much larger area is referred to as Greater Metropolitan Lagos or Lagos Megacity Region which is a continuous built-up land area of additional 1,535.4 square kilometers 592.8 square miles, comprising sprawls in LGAs situated next to Lagos' eastern and western city limits in Lagos State, and beyond northern limits, spilling into the LGAs in adjoining Ogun State. Ogun State LGAs within Greater Metropolitan Lagos majorly include, Obafemi Awode, Sagamu, IFO, Adu Odo, Ota and part of Ukoro. Today, the word Lagos most often refers to the urban area, called Metropolitan Lagos, in Nigeria, which includes both the islands of the former municipality of Lagos and the mainland suburbs. Lagos state government is responsible for some of the utilities including roads and transportation, power, water, health and education. Metropolitan Lagos extends over 16 of the 20 LGAs of Lagos State, and contains about 85% of the population of Lagos State, and includes semi-rural areas. Lagos City has a considerable number of high-rise buildings that dominate its skyline. Most of the tall buildings are located in the downtown central business district. Lagos was the former capital city of Nigeria but it has since been replaced by Abuja. Abuja officially gained its status as the capital of Nigeria on 12 December 1991, although the decision to move the federal capital had been made in NOW Act No. 6 of 1976. Lagos is also home to the High Court of the Lagos State Judiciary, housed in an old colonial building on Lagos Island. Topic. Census data for Lagos Although the 2006 National Population Census of Nigeria credited the metropolitan area with a population figure of 7,937,932, the figure is at variance with some projections by the UN and other population agencies and groups worldwide. 
The population figure of Lagos State given by the Lagos State Government is 17,553,924. It was based on claimed conducted enumeration for social planning by the Lagos State Government parallel census, and it believes that since the inhabitants of the metropolitan area of Lagos constitute 88% of the Lagos State population, the population of metropolitan Lagos is about 15.5 million. A rejoinder to Lagos State Government views concluded that Lagos State concealed the fact that the population projection, for Lagos urban agglomeration by the UN agencies had been revised downwards substantially as early as 2003. It failed to interpret the two most important and fairly representative and reliable secondary data sets already in public domain, the National Identity Card Scheme and the 2003 voters' registration figures from INEC. The figures for 2007 voters' registration by INEC were an act subsequent to the release of the provisional census results and comprehensively corroborate, vindicate and validate the population figures in no uncertain terms. According to the official results of the 2006 census, there were 8,048,430 inhabitants in metropolitan Lagos. This figure was lower than anticipated, and has created controversy in Nigeria. Lagos Island, the central local government area and historic center of metropolitan Lagos, had a population of 212,700 at the 2006 census. Authorities of Lagos State have attacked the results of the 2006 census, accusing the Nigerian National Population Commission of having undercounted the population of the state. This accusation is denied by the National Population Commission. A study found that research carried out by Africopolis, the African subsidiary of Egeopolis backed by the Agence Française de Développement, in addition to the cross-referencing of official figures with more scientific independent research concluded that the 2006 census figures for Lagos State of about 9 million were valid and that the state's own assessments are inflated. Lagos is, by most estimates, one of the fastest growing cities in the world. Lagos is currently experiencing a population increase of about 275,000 persons per annum. In 1999 the United Nations predicted that the city's metropolitan area, which had only about 290,000 inhabitants in 1950, would exceed 20 million by 2010 and thus become one of the ten most populated cities in the world. There is a huge spectrum of wealth distribution among the people that reside in Lagos. It ranges from the very wealthy to the very poor. Lagos has attracted many young people and families seeking a better life from all other parts of Nigeria and beyond and this has also contributed to its cosmopolitan status. Some people are leaving Lagos and Nigeria in search of better living conditions. Cities like Townsville in Australia are very popular with expats and have services set up to assist people in settling into their new life. Topic: <inaudible> Economy <inaudible> <inaudible> The city of Lagos is a major economic focal point in Nigeria, generating around 10% of the country's GDP. Most commercial and financial business is carried out in the central business district situated on the island. This is also where most of the country's commercial banks, financial institutions and major corporations are headquartered. Lagos is also the major information communications and telecommunications ICT hub of West Africa and potentially, the biggest ICT market in the continent. Lagos is developing a 24-hour economy and has also been ranked as one of the most expensive cities in the world. In some parts of Lagos, residents have one of the highest standards of living in Nigeria and in Africa. At the same time, a sizable proportion of the residents live in slums without access to piped water and sanitation. The Port of Lagos is Nigeria's leading port and one of the largest and busiest in Africa. 
It is administered by the Nigerian Ports Authority and it is split into three main sections, Lagos Port, in the main channel next to Lagos Island, Apapa Port site of the container terminal, and Tin Can Port, both located in Batagri Creek, which flows into Lagos Harbour from the west. The port features a railhead. The port has seen growing amounts of crude oil exported, with export figures rising between 1997 and 2000. Oil and petroleum products provide 14% of GDP and 90% of foreign exchange earnings in Nigeria as a whole. Topic: Culture. Topic: Music and film industry. Lagos is famous throughout Africa for its music scene. Lagos has a vibrant nightlife and has given birth to a variety of styles such as Saqqara music, Nigerian hip hop, highlife, juju, fuji, and afrobeat. Lagos is the center of the Nigerian movie industry, often referred to as Nollywood. Idumota Market on Lagos Island is the primary distribution center. Many films are shot in the Festac area of Lagos, where the World Festival of Black Arts was held. Igenmu is home to the primary center for the performing arts and artistes in Nigeria, the National Arts Theater. James Brown performed in Lagos in 1970. Paul McCartney recorded his fifth post Beatles album, Band on the Run, in an Emmy studio in Lagos in August and September 1973. Other foreign musicians who have also performed in the city include Sean Paul, Snoop Dogg, 50 Cent, Akon, Jarul, Ashanti, Usher, Shaggy, R. Kelly, especially during the Star Mega Jam, Shakira, John Legend, Boys 2 Men T. Pain, Brian McKnight, Jays, Mary J. Blige, Beyonce, Brandy, Sierra, Carrie Hilson and Lauren Hill, among others. Sport Football is Lagos' most popular sport. Prominent Lagos football clubs include Bridge Boys FC MFM FC and First Bank, both play in Nigeria National League, the second tier of Nigerian football. The Nigeria national football team, also known as the Super Eagles, used to play almost all of their home games in Lagos at the National Stadium in Suruliri. Much later, games were played at the then new Abuja National Stadium in Abuja for some time. However, games are now mostly played at the newer Godswill Akpabio International Stadium in UYO, which is the default home of the Super Eagles. Lagos also hosted the second All-African Games in 1973. Topic. Tourism Lagos, subsequent to the re-modernization project achieved by the previous administration of Governor Raji Babatundi Fashola, is gradually becoming a major tourist destination, being one of the largest cities in Africa and in the world. Lagos is currently taking steps to become a global city. The 2009 I.O. Carnival, a yearly festival originated from Iperu Remo, Ogun State, which took place on 25 April, was a step toward world city status. Currently, Lagos is primarily known as a business oriented and a fast paced community. Lagos has become an important location for African and black cultural identity. Lots of festivals are held in Lagos. Festivals vary in offerings each year and may be held in different months. Some of the festivals are Festac Food Fair held in Festac Town annually, IO Festival, Lagos Black Heritage Carnival, Lagos Carnival, Echo International Film Festival, Lagos Seafood Festac Festival, Lagos Photo Festival and the Lagos Jazz Series, which is a unique franchise for high-quality live music in all genres with a focus on jazz. Established in 2010, the popular event takes place over a three- to five-day period at selected high-quality outdoor venues. 
The music is as varied as the audience itself and features a diverse mix of musical genres from rhythm and blues to soul, afrobeat, hip-hop, bebop, and traditional jazz. The festivals provide entertainment of dance and song to add excitement to travelers during a stay in Lagos. Lagos has a number of sandy beaches by the Atlantic Ocean, including Elagushi Beach and Alpha Beach. Lagos also has a number of private beach resorts including Anagbi Grand Beach Resort and several others in the outskirts. Lagos has a variety of hotels ranging from three-star to five-star hotels, with a mixture of local hotels such as Echo Hotels and Suites, Federal Palace Hotel and franchises of multinational chains such as Intercontinental Hotel, Sheraton and Four Points by Sheraton. Other places of interest include the Tafawa Balewa Square, Festac Town, the Nike Art Gallery, Freedom Park, Lagos and the Cathedral Church of Christ, Lagos. Cuisine <coughs> 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 Some of the famous cuisines in Lagos include indigenous delicacies such as eba and aguzi, amala and yudu, jolif, ofada rice, plantains locally called dodo, beans, suya spicy shish kebab or spiced roasted beef, which is consumed in local clubs and bars with a bottle of cold beer, and eba, made from cassava and eaten with soups prepared with vegetables and mixture of spices and herbs. Other cuisines range from local ones like ayan pounded yam made from yam flour, amala, asaro, which is usually eaten with various kind of vegetables, and aguzi melon soup to European, Middle Eastern, and Asian cuisine. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Education. The Lagos State Government operates state schools. The education system is the 6-3-3-4 system, which is practiced throughout the country as well as by many other members of the economic community of West African states. The levels are primary, junior secondary school JSS, senior secondary school SSS, and university. All children are offered basic education, with special focus now on the first nine years. Many of the schools in Nigeria are federally funded and usually are boarding schools. A few examples are Federal Government College Odogbolu FG Kodogbolu, Federal Government Girls College Sagamu FGGCSA Gamu, and Federal Government College Kano FGC Kano. The state of Lagos has its own federally funded high schools namely Federal Government College Ijanakan also known as FGC Lagos, King's College and Queen's College. Lagos is home to various post-secondary schools, universities and other vocational institutions that are either operated by the government or private entities. Vocational schools Institute for Industrial Technology IIT, founded in 2000, IIT is a technical vocational school for male youth from families with limited resources. Its educational model is based on the dual training system. Polytechnics. Yaba College of Technology founded in 1934, the college is Nigeria's first higher educational institution and third in Africa. The college is a center of culture and heritage. Currently it has student enrollment of over 16,000. Lagos State Polytechnic is a polytechnic comprising more than six schools including private polytechnics and was founded 25 years ago. Its main campus resides at Ikorodu, along Shagamu Road. Lagos City Polytechnic, located at 6 8 Bashiru Away Street, off Sambiat Abiola Road formerly Medical Road, Akeja, this is the first private polytechnic in Nigeria. It was established in 1990 by ENGR. Babatundi Adufuwa. ENGR. 
Adufuwa hails from Okei in Ijibu Northeast Local Government Area of Ogun State. Grace Polytechnic Wolex Polytechnic Federal College of Fisheries and Marine Technology is a monotechnic that offers courses in fisheries technology, general science, marine engineering and nautical science. Federal College of Education Tech Akoka Topic. Universities The University of Lagos Unilag Akoka, is a large institution dating from 1962, with over 55,000 students. It comprises 13 faculties, run by over 4,000 staff. Lagos State University LASU is a multi-campus university established in the year 1983 and owned by the Lagos State Government. The main campus is located at Ojo, along the lagos Batagri Expressway. Pan-Atlantic University formerly known as Pan-African University has a business school LBS, a school of media and communication SMC, and an entrepreneurial development center EDC, specialized in providing short courses for SMEs. Lagos Business School LBS is the most famous of them all, awarding world-class MBA and EMBA. The School of Media and Communication is also known for its pragmatic communication courses in the field of journalism, media and marketing. SMC awards BSc, MSc, and PhD in social science courses. Founded in 1996 and awarded university status in 2002. The university also places some emphasis on the study of art, running the Virtual Museum of Modern Nigerian Art. National Open University of Nigeria is the first open university in Nigeria. It is located on Amadu Bello Way, Victoria Island, Lagos. Caleb University is a private university located at Imoda, Lagos. Lagos State College of Health Technology is an institution that runs health courses such as health information management, pharmacist tech, medical laboratory tech, community health extension and environmental health technology. It is located in Yaba. Lagos State University College of Medicine LASUCOM, Akeja Lagos University Teaching Hospital Luth, IDI Araba Mushin, Lagos Topic. Healthcare Lagos has many hospitals and medical facilities, some of which have accomplished feats in Nigeria's medical history. For example, the oldest Nigerian hospital is located in the city as well as West Africa's first air-operated emergency medical service, which commenced in the city. The Lagos healthcare system is generally divided into public and private sectors that provide medical services at the primary, secondary, and tertiary levels. Although the private hospitals are usually more expensive, it does not necessarily translate to better health care delivery. Topic. Transportation Topic. Highways Lagos has one of the largest and most extensive road networks in West Africa. It also has suburban trains and some ferry services. Highways are usually congested in peak hours, due in part to the geography of the city, as well as to its explosive population growth. Lagos is also linked by many highways and bridges. A new rail system that is supposed to span the length of the Batagri Expressway is currently under construction. The Lagos Ibadan Expressway and the Lagos Abiokuta Expressway are the major controlled access highways in the north of the city and serve as interstate highways to Oyo State and Ogun State, respectively. 
To the west the congested Lagos Batagri Expressway serves outlying towns such as Festival Town, which was the location for the 1977 Festival of Black Arts and Culture 77. Lagos's importance as a commercial center and port and its strategic location have led to it being the end point of three trans-African highway routes using Nigeria's national roads. The Trans-West African Coastal Highway leaves the city as the Batagri Expressway to Benin and beyond as far as Dakar and Nouakchott. The Trans-Sahara Highway to Algiers, which is close to completion, leaves the city as the Lagos Ibadan Expressway. Lagos State has a bus rapid transit (BRT) system. The first phase was completed in February 2008. It is expected to operate along eight routes using specially designated bus rapid transit lanes running through the city, with the aim of expanding to other routes in the future. The first phase of the Lagos BRT runs 19 kilometers 12 miles through Ikorodu Road and Funcho Williams Avenue up to CMS. After weeks of test runs, operations started on 17 March 2008, six months earlier than planned. Also, the signature color of Lagos State 14-seater bus known as Danfo is yellow with a touch of black. It has been estimated that the system will transport about 10,000 passengers in each direction per hour during peak travel times. At these times traffic congestion, called Go slow, by Lagosians, can be extreme. The Lamada Bus Rapid Transit Corridor covers a distance of about 22 kilometers, 14 miles. The system is run by two operators, NURTW Cooperative, Nigerian Union of Road Transport Workers, and Lagbus, a Lagos state government-owned asset management company that contributes about 180 high-capacity buses for the implementation of the first phase mile 12 to CMS BRT light system. Topic: <laughs> Rail An extensive urban rail system, Lagos Rail Mass Transit, running through the Lagos metropolis is currently under construction. Several intercity and commuter trains serve Lagos through the Lagos Terminus Railway Station. Lagos is currently the world's largest city proper in term of population which does not have grade-separated rapid transit system. Topic. Ferries Lagos State Ferry Services Corporation runs a few regular routes, for example between Lagos Island and the mainland, served by modern ferries and wharves. Private boats run irregular passenger services on the lagoon and on some creeks. Topic. Air. Lagos is served by Murtala Mohamed International Airport, one of the largest and busiest airports in Africa. The MMIA is Nigeria's premier international air gateway. The airport's history dates back to colonial times, around the time of the Second World War. The current international airport terminal was built and commissioned over 40 years ago, in 1978. The terminal opened officially March 15, 1979. The airport had been known simply as the Lagos International Airport. It was, however, renamed for the late Nigerian head of state, General Murtala Mohamed, who died in 1976. The airport terminal has been renovated several times since the 1970s but its most radical makeover began in 2013, following the launch of the federal government's multi-billion Naira remodeling, rehabilitation program for its airports nationwide. Under the remodeling work there, by late in 2014, the MMLA lounge area had been expanded to four times its previous size and new passenger handling conveyor systems installed which can handle over 1,000 passengers per hour. A second airport, Leki EPE International Airport is proposed. Topic. Bridges. <laughs> 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 
Topic: Notable people. Nelson Aguilar, professional American football player, Super Bowl 52 champion with the Philadelphia Eagles in 2018. Rilwan Akiolu, Oba, traditional ruler of Lagos. Akinwanmi Ambode, former governor of Lagos State. Agbani Darego, Miss Nigeria 2001, semi-finalist Miss Universe 2001 and Miss World 2001. Buchi Emesheda, novelist. Babatundi Fashola, former governor of Lagos and current Minister of Power, Works and Housing. Bo George, politician. Hakim Olajuwon, professional basketball player. Babajid Sanwo Olu, governor of Lagos State. Bola Tanubu, former governor of Lagos State. Funcho Williams, politician and one-time aspirant to the office of Lagos State Governor. Topic: International Relations. Topic: Twin towns and sister cities. Lagos is twinned with Gary, Indiana, United States, since 1991 Atlanta, Georgia, United States, since 1974 See also List of largest cities List of governors of Lagos State Notes <laughs>